Thank you for tuning in to Capital Jazz TV. I'm your host, Jodine Dorsey. We are on the 10th anniversary of the Super Cruise. And of course, you know, I had to drag Eric Roberson into the studio. Kicking and streaming. I mean, I, they dragged me all the way here against right. my will. But I'm here. I'm but, glad. But you're and, here. And honored. You're, you, and you're always here on yes. the Super Cruise. Why not? Because the people love you. Well, that's good. That's good. And you know, I'm glad this is actually my 10th year. Um, so, wow, you're from so the beginning as well. From the very beginning. From the very beginning. That's a complete lie, but it felt good at the time. <laughs> it is uh, the yeah, lie. Yeah, it's a, it's a complete <laughs> lie. But it felt good for a second there because it's the 10th anniversary. I'm really, this is my sixth year. Six years. Six. But I was here in spirit for the first four. I, you know, right, 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 <laughs> yeah. right. right. Yeah. So the, from the first time to now, what's been the difference? What's been... Well, I mean, I don't, I can't say I was completely unknown, but I wasn't, uh, I wasn't, I didn't have the responsibility I have now. I was on strictly the first year as a as an artist and a performer. Mm -hmm. And really, I just, I, for me, I really took the opportunity what this is. It's a, it's a boat full of music lovers mm -hmm. and people that love entertainment. And every stage and every opportunity I could to showcase my talent, we, we took advantage of it. Which you do And well. they kept having me back, and, and I'm honored to come back because I love it. But you're now doing more than your artist here, artistry here. You're hosting the Underground Soul. Yeah. You're hosting the Soul Sessions, Open Jam, Mic Sessions, and yeah. uh, I mean, you're you're doing also so dominating much. the poker table. I'm hosting the Celebrity Poker Game this year. I haven't won yet, <laughs> and I did hear Poker Queen that you did uh, throw a little shade here, and I didn't. I, I haven't won because it's my job to host. I'm not supposed to just steal everybody's but money. But you're supposed and, to know how to play the game. I Eric, know how to play the game. That's where you. I pay for my internet from that poker table every that's, year. That's where you fall short. Next question. Next question. <laughs> Next question. I'm just. This is just disrespectful. This is just, so. But I love it. I love. Right. I love. You know. To me, you know, especially the Underground Soul Lounge. Mm -hmm. It's really showcasing artists that people may not know. My goal is for everyone on this boat mm -hmm. to leave the boat discovering someone new. Absolutely, and you, you know? do that all so well because what I love about you, especially with the soul sessions, sessions that I saw one of the nights on the Super Cruise, um, Bilal was performing, and, mm -hmm. and no, it wasn't Bilal, it was I think Steve was performing. Okay. And Bilal and um, some others started singing background yeah. for him. Yeah. And I'm thinking to myself, Oh my gosh, this independent artist who sings background for everyone has Bilal singing back up for him. him. Yeah. How yeah. awesome is that experience? But that's what it's supposed to be. It's supposed to be the community. My very first cruise here, mm -hmm. the very first night, there was a jam session. And they pulled me on that jam session, and I did a duet, a freestyle duet with Patty Austin while George Duke was playing the keys. What? And George Duke is by far one of top three the, of my favorite artists right, of all time. Greatest so, of all time. So when you think, when you think of that, you know, it's just trying to continue that legacy. And yeah. think of how Steve felt when he's singing and he looks back and Bilal is backing him up, as well as when Bilal is singing, Steve, Steve is backing, backing him, him up. up. But that's right. what it's supposed to be. Right. And that's what people right. love so much about, about this cruise, that you, you see so many people collaborating. Me and Michael Collier have, have grown to be such great friends because the friendship started on, on stage. The cruise, yeah. It started, not right. only started on the, on, the, on, the, on the cruise, but it started on the stage because he would pull me up on, on his stage, I'll pull him up on my that's stage, great. and we just have a, a great time. That's great. So I have to go a little personal with you as yes. well. You've had three children. Yes. Yes. I think the last interview you had one. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. And, and now it's something about the cruises, you know. Right. About the cruises. You, you have three now. My wife gets my wife gets pregnant either as soon as I get off the boat or on the boat or something <laughs> oh. thereof. I've done six cruises, uh, and and my oldest is six actually. So he was right. he was conceived right before I got on the boat. That was more like. I'm gonna miss you. Let me impregnate you before I go on the boat. And then after that was all the <laughs> celebratory of the cruise. Right, right, right. Like that. So she's not on this time. This is the, the first one in about three years she's missed. Mm -hmm. uh, because she's she's breastfeeding back at home with the, with the newborn, my, my little Max. I love him to death, you know. So but she's here, she's here in spirit and, and she'll be on uh, the Soul Cruise headed to Cuba that yes. I'm one of the hosts for in yes. February. Hopefully you join us. Yes. And so now that you have three. Yeah. You got the family now. It's, yes. you, it's, 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 you got a foot, a mini football team. You, you, can, <laughs> yeah, yeah, you, yeah. you got a quarterback. Yeah. You yep, got the yep. tight. You know, you, you, you're almost there. Running back, I got a running back, wide receiver, and quarterback. How has this affected your work? Like, how are you able to still tour, to still create? How do you even create now? Well, like, it has to get done. It's how? Pick, I mean, it has to get done. Well, my last three albums, my kids have been on my lap 
while I'm recording. They're used to the studio, they're used to the vocal booth. Uh, first of all, Dee Maurice uh, Mosaic, uh, some of the records was done at my studio, at my house, mm -hmm. and he had to learn very, very quickly that he's, half, it's half daycare, half studio. <laughs> And I remember the first day he came to record, he called me going, what is happening? I said, oh, yeah, the kid's going to be with you the whole time, just so you know that. Wow. He had to learn very quickly. And uh, even the newborn, he's six months. I got one of them little harness things, and, and I, and I keep singing, it with me. I'm well, singing and working on music the whole night. I'll be cutting horns or whatever. And the kids are just in there. And this and the cruises are the longest I'm away from home. Uh-huh. You know, most uh -huh. of the time I only, uh, only travel and tour really uh, – Late Thursday, maybe Friday, Saturday. I'm back home Monday taking the kids to school, cooking pancakes and the, and the whole night. I changed my entire tour schedule when my second son you came. You changed your entire lifestyle. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And thank God for the internet. I mean, truth be told, I'm, I'm FaceTiming my, my family, my kids every day. I make sure the kids are, are I'm wishing them good night each mm -hmm. night, you know. And, mm -hmm. and so thank God for a good Wi-Fi on the boat to allow me to do that. You know, it's it's... It's still being a father, you know what I mean? Right, yeah, I pride, right. my, I pride myself on being a host, being a singer, a songwriter, but I pride myself on being a father uh, and a husband just as much. Is that easy for you because your father's still involved? Yeah, I mean, I've, I've had the best examples you can you could possibly I, I imagine. I can imagine. You know, and, I I'm, and imagine. My, you know, my parents are on this this cruise with me. They I usually know. are the ones watching the kids, mm -hmm. and uh, and they're having a blast. My, my father met uh, Walter from the OJs today, oh, one of his man. biggest fans. Yeah, so you know, it's, yeah. it's a great. And your father's way to get a back. singer too. Which he sang with me yesterday. He sang with me yesterday. He stole the show. I mean, standing ovation after he finished Love singing. it. Love yeah. it. So what's next for you? What's next is uh, I'm actually producing an event called Note for Note. It's a benefit concert for the American Cancer Society. Okay. Um, and just giving back, whatever I can do. I'm almost done. I'm like 90% done with my next album, which is oh. untitled. I don't know what it's going to be called, but oh. I'm pretty excited about it. I and it's releasing when? I would probably say sometime after February, okay. February, March, April, somewhere in that in that line. But I'm really excited about it and just uh, you know still touring and still a good touring. Time. Okay. Yeah. And so, how do people keep in contact with you? Very easily. My okay. phone number is six zero nine six nine. Wait, wait, no. Social media. Let's keep oh, it. Let the, oh, oh, oh. <laughs> you can follow me on social media at uh, ericrobersonmusic.com. Um, mm -hmm. Or Instagram, Arrow44. I, I'm, for some reason, foolishly have a different social media name for everything. Uh, Twitter is I'm Eric Roberson. Uh, and even Facebook is somewhere about the derivative of Eric Roberson of some, of some okay. sort. You know, you can just, or just shoot up a, a Batman signal and I'll show up. You show you know, up. I'm and in you'll your sing. town. And, I, and you'll sing it. Yeah, you'll of course. Of right, course. Right. Na, 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 na. Eric <sighs> Roberson. That's, huh. I have an idea. Okay, what's your I, idea? I have an idea. Oh, I Lord. like I, I like that. I like that idea. Yeah, we we'll do the Eric Robeson <laughs> tour with, with Batman signals. Uh huh. Yes. Uh huh. Uh huh. And what's next We're, for you, Jodine? For me? Oh my gosh. Well, you know, um, I'm still hosting Apollo Music Cafe in Harlem, and um, more involved. I'm getting more involved in Capital Jazz. And Love it. You know, just making sure we create pathways for Before we go any further, I always say this, I'm very proud of this girl. Aww, You're just you. amazing and you're taking over everything. I'm and not. And that's a good thing. I'm not. I'm you just, are. I mean, you're, you're doing your thing. Just my little corner of the world. Jody's see what corner. I did, see what I did there? Yeah, I like that. I, did I like that. That's called segment. <laughs> nice. Well, Eric, it's always a pleasure to see you on Pleasure's the Super mine. Cruise. Pleasure's always mine. a pleasure to see you perform. Thank you for all that you do. Not only for not only for the cruisers and the, and the patrons, but what you do for artists as well. Perfect. You and do you're a welcome. Lot. You do a lot for the artists. And I love them. Of course you do. And they love you too. I glad, I'm glad about that. <laughs> you behaved yourself very well in this interview. I'm very proud of you. <laughs> Thank you so much. This is Eric Robeson. I'm your host, Jodine Dorsey. We are on the Super Cruise, and you are tuned in to Capital Jazz TV.